Hey everyone, welcome back to the Cooking Everything Outdoors show. Today we're making Dutch oven white chicken chili, the cooking outdoors way, of course. So for those of you that don't know what white chicken chili is, it's basically, it's a white chili. Uh, it's super fast to make. It is really easy to make. Ingredients wise, about 10 items is all you need to make this chili. To start with, you're going to need about a one and a half chicken breast, maybe two depending on the size. Mine were absolutely massive, so I got about a pound and a half of chicken breast. You'll need three cans of uh, cannellini beans. We're going to use two and a half and I'm going to reserve a half a can and I'll show you what for in just a minute. You'll need about two stalks of celery and you want that uh, diced, one large onion diced, one good sized can of diced chilies. These are fire roasted chilies with the juice, maybe a teaspoon of black pepper, three to four garlic cloves minced, two heaping tablespoons of Cajun seasoning, tablespoon of olive oil, pat of butter, and a full 32 ounces of chicken stock. We're going to be cooking this recipe in a 12 inch Dutch oven and using about 20 coals, maybe a little bit more if the cook takes a little longer. I might have to add some a little bit later. Because I'm sauteing my chicken and the onions and celery and such, I'm putting all my heat on the bottom of the Dutch oven. Now that we have all the coals underneath the Dutch oven, I want to preheat this for a good 10 minutes. I'm going to add my olive oil, start sauteing my chicken. Olive oil. Now our chicken. Once you start getting some color on your chicken, add those spices in there. The more the better, but just be aware of the heat. Now once your chicken's done, not overcooked, but just finished cooking, we're gonna take and we're gonna remove that from the Dutch oven and set it to the side for just a few minutes. And if you have a lot of broth in there, you want to set that aside with the chicken as well. All right, we'll start with our pat of butter. Our onions in there. And start scraping up all those little bits that the chicken's left in there with the seasoning. We'll add our celery. Once your onions and celery have sauteed down to where they're starting to become translucent, that's when you want to add your garlic. Add the chicken back in without the reserved uh, broth from previously cooking. You get that all mixed up. We'll bring the chicken back up to temp. So now's a great time to think about thickening up your chili before you add your liquid ingredients. And to do that, we can add some flour uh, in there just to make a nice little roux. How much? Well, maybe a teaspoon, maybe, maybe a tablespoon or so. You just want to add our flour in and you want to mix that all in. If you don't mix it in, it's going to be lumpy later. Okay. Good and mixed up. Now, we want to add our black pepper. Again, this is going to add some heat to it. We're going to add our chilies. We'll go back and add the, the broth from cooking the chicken. Now we're going to add two and a half cans of beans. And this has a little bit of the juice in there, not much. I did drain most of it off. Plus a half. Give that a good stir. Oh, I wish you guys could smell this. Now we're going to add our chicken stock. So now that you have all your ingredients in the pot, it's time to bring it up to a boil and then simmer it. You may want to add a few more coals on the bottom at this point to keep that heat going because I've been cooking for about 20 minutes now or so. So those coals are starting to die down 
Uh, I'm going to cook it with the lid on and I'm going to add a couple of coals on the top just to keep the heat consistent. So our chili has been simmering for about 30 minutes. Let's take a look. Now this is the consistency that uh, white chili is typically found at. Uh, you can take and add the bean mix which I, I went and I just took a fork and I just mixed up and, and smashed the beans until it made a little puree. And we'll add this just the chili just to show you how it thickens up a little bit. So you can see it thickens it up just a little bit more. Uh, this is just perfect and I'm going to stop right here. We're going to bowl some up. There we go. Well, there you have it. It's time to eat, actually. Um, Dutch oven, white chicken chili. Uh, cooking outdoor style. Uh, this is the point where you start topping some things off. I'll uh, start with a little green onion. I'll add a little bit of parsley there. And a little bit of cheese. Super happy. Um, this is fabulous. Quick, easy, like 10 ingredients. But you can do this. It's super easy. Um, I hope you liked it. Give a big thumbs up if you do. Uh, leave a comment. Love to hear your thoughts on this. And as always, I will see you when I see you.